So my name is Matt Warshower. Uh, I live in West Hartford, Connecticut. I'm a professor of history at Central Connecticut State University where I've been there, oh geez, uh, 20 years now, uh, teaching political and constitutional history and you know, sort of uh, my, my research and public, publication expertise is in uh, early American political history, but I'm interested in the history of the United States across the board. You know, I've always been into Halloween, like super big into Halloween. You know, naturally, I, I wedded my, my two loves of doing Halloween stuff and doing history. And so one of the things with my displays, I started to get to the point where I wanted the displays to be a little more didactic, meaning that I wanted there to be some lessons in there and get people to remember things or learn things that our nation has forgotten. And I know from history, effigies go back, I mean, they're the heart uh, of America. Effigies go back to the American Revolution, uh, building you know, sort of mock figures um, out of whatever you have at hand and, you know, parading them through the streets. I mean, this goes back a long, long way, back to the days of tarring and feathering. And so I, uh, you know, I wasn't going to tar and feather anybody. This is sort of the, the theme piece. I, I did a little bit of light bright thing where I poked holes in it and stuck Halloween lights through it. So the, the theme of democracy can die. All the sort of my messy workshop stuff with Halloween things everywhere. Democracy is challenged and, and I think many Americans believe that, you know, the country's been around long enough, the Constitution has been around long enough, that they just sort of assume, oh, it, it, it will always be. And that's not the case. When Trump is shouting out that the, the press is the enemy of the people and reporters are feeling threatened. Fake, fake. Disgusting news. Literally, that's where we are. You know, CNN, fake news, MSNBC, you know, that's really the enemy of the people. I think Donald Trump is the most dangerous president, the most uneducated president, the most belligerent president. Uh, he is a very, very real threat, not only to this nation, but to the concept of democratic rule. And Americans better wake up. They, they just better wake up. I guess I'm trying to spark conversations and I actually think I do a good job of it.